after the 2011 report of the Namibia Population and Housing Census, the Regional Councillor of the Kalahari constituency in the Omaheke region responded with an initiative, Kalahari Homeless Shelter Project, that aims to replace improvised housing or sheds constructed with plastic and dilapidated material. These community members are vulnerable to extreme weather conditions such as rain, wind, cold and heat, as well as snake and insect bites and fire. Speaking at the groundbreaking ceremony of the five houses to be built in Chaka, the patron of the project, Honorable Cornelius Shilunga, stated there is so much good a decent house can offer to an individual. The shelter or home plays a very significant role in a person's life. <laughs> People have fundamental attachments to place and space. Home and shelter provide human beings with security, control, belonging, identity, and privacy. The Deputy Minister wanted to see to it that they not only provide shelter, but places that will restore the dignity of the people. I call upon the contractor who is entrusted with this responsibility to do justice in constructing of these houses. The project targets to construct 30 to 60 brick houses every financial year, and for this year, their budget is still open for support as the funds raised so far are only enough to construct the 25 houses. So far, the program has raised 600,000 Namibian dollars. And I would like to sincerely register our profound gratitude to all the partners that made this venture possible. Speaking at the event, the regional governor had this to say. This groundbreaking should thus serve as an inspiration to all of us. We should be reminded that good work can be achieved by community that shares a common vision. Kalahari constituency has proven that it can be done and one can only hope that the constituencies, the other constituencies, will follow suit. He further encouraged the elected councillors and all leaders to be more action-oriented. Reporting for NBC, Matilda Kulo, Chaka.